Hi friends, my name is Deepthi. Welcome to Learn English with Deepthi. Today, let's take a look at Thanksgiving. What is Thanksgiving? Why do people celebrate it? And how is Thanksgiving celebrated? Today, let's take a look at all of these things. I'm going to write a small essay about this. You can use this if you need to write an essay or you can use it as a script for a speech about Thanksgiving also. So I'll tell you the traditions and the story behind Thanksgiving. And then as we go along, we will write little bits of it. By the end of it, you will have like a whole essay or a whole script for a speech. So let's start. So what is Thanksgiving? It is a very popular holiday celebrated by the people of the United States. Uh, it's also celebrated in other countries like Canada, Brazil, etc. But I'm not going to go into detail about that. Uh, in this video, I'll focus about the Thanksgiving that is celebrated in the United States. Thanksgiving is celebrated by Americans on the fourth Thursday in November every year. So what is Thanksgiving? Why do we celebrate it? The story is a historical one. The first people who came to live in America are called pilgrims. They came from Europe. They came on a ship called Mayflower and landed on the east coast of America in a place called Plymouth, which is near Boston. So the pilgrims had a very hard time in the first year after their arrival. A lot of them were sick, many of them died, their harvest wasn't very good. So they were having a very, very difficult time and the winter was very harsh also. So they met some of the natives of the continent called Native Americans. So these natives helped out the pilgrims. They taught them how to fish and how to hunt. They also told them which crops to plant. And the next year, the pilgrims had a wonderful harvest thanks to the help of the Native Americans. So to thank them for their help, the pilgrims invited the Native Americans to join them in a wonderful feast. And that feast that celebrated the unity between the Native Americans and the pilgrims is considered the first Thanksgiving. It took place in 1621. We celebrate Thanksgiving now to commemorate that event. But today Thanksgiving is considered more as a way to just say thanks for the blessings of the previous year. Okay, so let's write this paragraph about the story of Thanksgiving. So here we go. Thanksgiving is one of the most popular holidays celebrated by Americans. It falls on the fourth Thursday in November every year. This holiday is celebrated to commemorate the first Thanksgiving feast that took place in 1621 between the earliest European settlers and the Native Americans. The first people to come and live in America were European colonists who are commonly referred to as pilgrims. They sailed to America on a ship called the Mayflower and landed on the east coast of the US in a place called Plymouth. However, they had a very hard time in the new land. Many of them died due to illnesses and their crops were damaged by the harsh winter. At that time, the natives who lived in America came to their aid. They taught the pilgrims ways to hunt and fish and also showed them which crops work best in the American climate. Because of the help of the Native Americans, the pilgrims had a great harvest the next year. To thank the natives for their help, the pilgrims invited them to a grand feast to celebrate their harvest. This is considered the first Thanksgiving. Today, Thanksgiving is a time for families to come together and give thanks for the blessings of the previous year. More people travel to visit their families during Thanksgiving than during any other time of the year. So how was Thanksgiving celebrated? What are some of the traditions of Thanksgiving? Let's talk about that next. The most important Thanksgiving tradition is the Thanksgiving dinner. People have a huge feast. The main dish is the roasted turkey. The other side dishes include mashed potatoes, stuffing, gravy, pumpkin pie or apple pie. You also have eggnog, cranberry sauce. These are all uh, part of the traditional Thanksgiving dinner. There's also a Thanksgiving Day Parade that happens every year in New York City. This parade is broadcasted live all over the country and people all over the country 
watch the parade. This parade includes huge helium balloons in all sorts of different shapes. Uh, and people gather around the sides of the street to watch the parade. There are also celebrities who perform during the parade and it is a, it is a big deal. Uh, the helium balloons are the stars of the parade. They come in all different shapes, particularly for of children characters like Spider-Man and Snoopy, uh, Thomas the Tank Engine. These are all characters who are made into huge helium balloons as big as uh, a building. They are huge. And the parade ends with a float that brings Santa Claus into town and it marks the official beginning of the holiday season. Another common Thanksgiving tradition is football games. There are a lot of football games scheduled for Thanksgiving Day and traditionally families while the Thanksgiving dinner is getting cooked, while the turkey is getting roasted, families get together, they sit and they watch the football game on television together. That is a, a tradition of Thanksgiving along with the parade. People watch the parade and the football games while the dinner gets ready. The day after Thanksgiving is called Black Friday in America. It's a big deal because all the stores have amazing deals that day. It's, it's the start of the holiday shopping season because during the Christmas holiday season, everybody buys presents for each other. So right after Thanksgiving on Black Friday is when most people start shopping and to bring in people to their stores, most of the stores will have amazing, the best deals of the year will be on Black Friday. So, there, so after Thanksgiving, you have dinner. The next morning you wake up and you go to shop Black Friday with your family. That is another part of Thanksgiving. In addition to giving thanks for our own blessings, most people use Thanksgiving as an opportunity to help those in our community. People donate their time or their money, the people volunteer, uh, people provide meals for other people who are less fortunate than them. So it's a wonderful holiday that brings people together and makes us aware of our own blessings and uh, helps us remember of those of who are not as fortunate as us and help each other out. So it, it is overall a wonderful holiday. Now let's write a small paragraph about the traditions of Thanksgiving and why it's a wonderful holiday. Today, Thanksgiving is a time for families to come together and give thanks for the blessings of the past year. More Americans travel to visit their families during Thanksgiving than any other time during the year. The traditional way to celebrate Thanksgiving is by making an elaborate meal consisting primarily of roast turkey and side dishes like mashed potatoes, stuffing, cranberry sauce, pumpkin pie, eggnog, etc. Every year, Americans also watch the annual Macy's Thanksgiving Day Parade held in New York City and broadcast live around the nation. The parade consists of giant helium balloons in the shapes of popular children's characters, live performances by celebrities, and it ends with a float bringing Santa Claus into town, officially welcoming the Christmas season. Another Thanksgiving tradition is families getting together and watching a football game with many teams scheduling games on Thanksgiving Day. People also use Thanksgiving as an opportunity to help others by volunteering their time or donating money or food to prepare and distribute Thanksgiving meals to those in need. Thanksgiving also marks the beginning of the holiday season in the U.S. The Friday after Thanksgiving is called Black Friday when stores all over the country offer their best deals to lure customers who start shopping for Christmas presents for their loved ones. Thanksgiving is a wonderful holiday that gives us the opportunity to be thankful for the blessings we have and to donate whatever we can to help those less fortunate than us. I hope this video has helped you understand a bit more about Thanksgiving, why it's celebrated, the story behind it, etc. And also learn to write a couple of paragraphs about this celebration. Uh, please like and share the video and please subscribe to my channel. Thank you for watching.